I mean, obviously, when we got the ruling from the judge, um, looking through that, he, he was quite clear that um, it was for Parliament to change and that it was good reason for them to do so. Uh, so I think they'll take that on board and I think that they will take action. It's a reasonably controversial issue because we can see this petition being presented and right behind you there's an opposing petition. Mm -hmm. Do you think the politicians have the courage to address this issue? I certainly hope they have the courage. Uh, I mean, my wife showed a lot of courage taking this to the courts and um, as a result of that I think we, we built up a huge groundswell of support across New Zealand uh, with ordinary New Zealanders actually starting to consider some of these issues and to actually form an opinion. And I think now we've come to a place where um, people do have an opinion and um, where they, 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 you know, when this comes to the House there'll be a lot, there'll be a lot of submissions and a lot of interest um, uh, to sort of see this go forward. What message would you have to those who oppose the petition? Well, uh, I think that uh, if, we, if, if this goes forward and we get some action, we, we will have um, the opportunity for them to present their views. Um, potentially at a select committee hearing or, or whatever form this takes. Um, so they will be heard. Um, but my personal view is that we, we need uh, death with dignity laws in New Zealand. This is an awkward question, forgive me, but if Lucretia was standing here right now, what do you think she would be saying to us and also to the public? Uh, what would Lucretia be saying? Mm. Uh, I think... Uh, I think she'd be saying thank you. Uh, I think she'd be saying thank you for all the, the, the support um, that she was shown um, when she took the court case and um, how sort of New Zealand sort of rallied around her and, um, uh, and gave her the strength to, to show up in the court those couple of days that she could. Um, yeah, I think that's what she'd say.